Hey, how you doing? Chronoebi here, and in this video series, we will be recreating this game right here. It is called Into the Gungeon, and the reason why we are doing this is because it has an interactive environment, procedurally generated dungeon, different types of guns with different features, different type of enemies, and posit with slight variations, in-game shop system for temporary upgrades and stuff, and overworld shop system for upgrades and stuff. Interactive UI system with multiple input support like controllers and keyboard support, as well as key binding features. It also has co-op game mode and the list just keeps on going. So what better way to learn game development than by just recreating a production ready game, am I right? And also creating those features that I said before separately is quite easy, but incorporating them in your game dev project is quite hard. So just follow along and let's try recreating every aspect of this game and I will try to do it with easy to understand and bite sized videos. So in this video, let's start by setting up our project. So if you're new to game development and don't have Unity, then go to unity.com and download Unity Hub from here. You'll go through some minor installation processes and you'll end up here. And then go to your installs and install the latest but long term support version of Unity Editor. And in our case, I recommend installing the 2021 version so that what I do and what you do will be somewhat consistent. We'll be building this game only for desktop so the platform features are not needed. And in my opinion, Visual Studio is also not needed because if you just install Visual Studio code and set it up for Unity, which will take you like five minutes and will give you almost all the features of Visual Studio, but it will do that for less than half the size of Visual Studio. So that's just my opinion. You don't have to follow it. But if you are going to, then in the next video, we'll set up Visual Studio code for Unity development. So once you're done, hit install and you'll get 2021 version and go to your project click on new click on 2d core because we're making a 2d game rename this project to i will rename it to enter the gungeon clue and hit create it takes a while to set it up but after that we're good to go so in the upcoming videos we'll set up vs code for unity and push this project into our github repository we'll also import every necessary asset into unity and then go straight to building the game so stay tuned and have a wonderful day guys thank you for watching i hope you like the video smash the like button hit subscribe follow me on discord and have a wonderful day bye bye